stream, but welcome to the stream. Hi. I'm uh, I'm uh, retweeting Chris's tweet right now about it. We're getting we're getting uh, we're letting you know some of the behind the scenes uh so something baseball inside baseball something like that I don't know I'm not I'm not uh I'm not up on the news game like I used to be yes cat yeah my cat is losing her mind. Oh, and then I'm pulling up your chat so I can talk with people if they do join the chat. There we go. I'm all set up now. Nice. All right. I have not been on webcam in a very long time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's been a it's been a long time since we've done this just in general. I mean, granted there hasn't been much to talk about. But did we even do Min Min? I don't even remember now. I don't think we did. I think Min Min happened... I think something was happening... I think for some reason or other I wasn't available when Min Min happened. Right, and then I just wasn't doing anything. Because that was like at the time frame where I was like really not doing anything online. And so I just, I, I just didn't do anything. That's right. <laughs> Man, when was Min Min revealed? I want to say seven to nine months ago. I don't remember for sure, though. Seven to nine months. Seventy-nine months ago. Seventy-nine months ago. Wow. When when was when it was revealed before, like years before Arms was even revealed. Yeah, that was the that was the funny thing. Everybody's trying to figure out like what what could they possibly be uh, be referencing with this character. Yeah, that's right. We had no idea. It was just an entirely new series that we'd never seen before. Yeah, it was just like, there's some kind of ramen girl, and I don't know. She's it, got noodle arms. It's those, it's those kinds of bold uh, choices that we've really come to respect Sakurai for. That's right. That's right. So Goku, right? Probably, yeah. yeah. Hard to imagine it being anyone else, really. <laughs> I mean, look. He's had he's had more games come out recently than like anybody else. I think, the it's, last, I think it's a safe bet. The last couple of characters have been like you know really predictable Bobby. first party Nintendo characters, right? We had Byleth, we had Min Min, so they're gonna have a big new like surprising out of this world third party, and obviously it's gonna be Goku. Yeah, <laughs> literally out of this world. Literally, literally, literally. He's, he's out. He's he's out of Earth. He's out of the realm of gaming. <laughs> and I'm all out of Earth. <laughs> um, yeah, hi, Bobby. Welcome to the stream. You're the first one. You win. Um, yeah, so I'm not entirely sure. Did we get confirmation that this is supposed to be a character from E3, or is that just what everybody's guessing? That's a speculation. And okay. I mean, it makes sense. The The idea is that all the like little trickly things that we've been seeing Nintendo announce were all planned for one big E3 presentation, right? A, a big E3 presentation that would have included like details of like, this is when Crown Tundra is releasing. There's this new Paper Mario game. We're celebrating Mario's 35th anniversary with uh, this collect this 3D All-Stars collection. Um, and and that all of the, or in Age of Calamity, this all would have been part of an E3 presentation. So the speculation is that this teaser, because we know it's just going to be a little three minute long thing, which means, so the speculation, right, is that since it's just a little three minute long thing, it's going to be a teaser for the character, but not the full, this character's ready yet. Um, so the speculation is that it would have been a teaser that would have played at the end of like E3 um, for, hey, here's the upcoming fighter, but instead they're showing it now. I wonder why they just didn't do... Why they, didn't, why they just didn't release the whole thing as a Nintendo Direct then. But I guess that's what everybody's um, wondered. My, my personal speculation on that is that they delayed the trailers or, or the, you know, showing off of all of these things until they were like absolutely 100% certain when the games were going to come out. That once the, um, you know... That's fair world because of events, the pandemic. Once the world events hit, they were like, we don't actually know. We can't promise that all these games are going to release at the times that we originally thought they were anymore. So we're going to wait to show them off until we know when we're 
going to be able to release them. That actually makes sense. Yeah, because we have no idea... We have no idea, like, how they actually handled that whole thing, like, development-wise. Yeah. I mean, even then, with the recent Pokemon uh, thing, I mean, they gave us a release date for Crown Dundra, but they still don't have a release date for the Pokemon Go Pokemon Home connectivity. That's still, like, eh, this will come out sometime this year, hopefully. I forgot that was a thing. Yeah. Did did the Pokemon DLC get delayed at all, or did they stay on target? Uh, I'm not sure, because I, I don't think they ever officially... That's been why I think one of Nintendo's strategies, too. They never gave us an official release date for Crown Tundra originally. They were like, oh, it'll come mm. out in 2020 sometime, like last year. Um, and so I think that's part of it, too, is is intentionally not revealing these release dates at all until they're, until they're certain. Okay. I, mean, I think I get... a lot of... I mean, I guess that all tracks... Uh, it's just it's it's funny like we literally this is the end of what literally has been the the longest drought in smash ultimate information that we've that we've ever had including from when the game was revealed to when we got like character reveals and more information about it yes it is yeah um and, and, and you know obviously it's because of what's been going on in the in the world but uh yeah. but yeah even so i mean for me, I know it doesn't feel like like I I still feel like September just started and it's already October as of today, which is crazy. I could have sworn that September just started. Yeah, that's fair. Chelsea sent me pictures of like decorating her entire house for Halloween, and I was like, I can't believe it's where we are. Yeah, it's like, isn't it a little bit early? It's like, no. Oh, like, right. <laughs> so, as far as who it is, uh huh. If it genuinely was somebody they're planning to reveal at E three, mm -hmm. it does stand to reason that it's likely a large third party character or like a huge fan demand character. That's a big speculation. Would be the one they would go with, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The last E three reveal was that dual reveal it was hero and banjo kazooie banjo. yeah which is that's a, that's a tough act to follow up <laughs> that's also the one that we accurately predicted so give us a pat on that's the back. true that's funny uh i forgot yeah so yeah no and because of that a lot of people are anticipating like a really big third party character i've even seen uh, a lot more gino speculation for for like master chief um, and I've seen a lot of hope for Gino. You know, someone who is, maybe he's not a huge third-party character, but he's a huge Smash-like anticipation from a very long time. I'm just wondering, like, where the fan demand even is at this point. Like, because we, we've seen, with all the reveals we've gotten so far, what is the actual most requested stuff at this point? If you want to take Source Gaming's, like, mega poll that they did over a very long period of time through lots of sources, it looks like Crash and Geno are in the top spots right now. I think Doom Slayer is pretty high up there still. Um, yeah. I don't understand some of these. Me either, but, you know. There's always going to be some characters that you're like... Oh, yeah, and some you're like, eh. I'm actually, which uh, I get flack for sometimes. Not never, like, serious flack, but, like, jokingly flack. I'm not big on Doom Slayer in Smash. Um, but that's just me. Same? It's... I don't know, like... Ugh. I guess the main thing... I, I, I guess the main thing is I, 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 feel, I feel weird when it comes to considering characters that you generally play from the first person perspective of just because mm. that means you don't have that much attachment to the actual like appearance of the character and then the character also usually doesn't have that much personality the doom slayer is notable in that he like does have like little things that he does so that's something but I don't know. It's, I, I guess I just feel like, cause have we have we had that happen yet in the series? Have we have we gotten a true first person character? Yeah, 
Not really. The closest I can think of is Samus because of her Prime appearances, but obviously, I mean, she was added to Smash Brothers before Prime existed, so. Yeah, and, you know, there was all the 2D games as well. Of oh, course. <laughs> Duck Hunt, that's a really good point. That's a really good point. That's a good point. Yeah, there we go. But, I mean, that combined that concept with the mascot character of Duck Hunt, which was the dog and the yeah. duck. So. Duck Hunt. Um... Oh, shoot. I was going to say something. I don't remember. Uh, oh, just something that Bobby was saying in chat uh, with uh, prepared for potential disappointment. Some people are are very excited by the idea. So I don't want to, like, bash it. But yeah. there are a lot of people who are expecting, like, something like a new Pokemon. And to be honest, I'm still – I'm actually – my I'm still on the train of thought that they wouldn't have done a spirit event for Sword and Shield if they were already planning on doing a character because they could have saved those spirits for a spirit event. Now, the argument to that is either A, they could specifically do it for Crown Tundra or uh, Isle of Armor DLC, which is viable, but also I think it would be weird if you were going to pick, like, one definitive Sword and Shield Pokemon for Smash Brothers that you'd pick one that's exclusively DLC. I think that would be weird. Um, and secondly, I mean, yeah, there's more spirits that they could add, but I mean, that's just always going to be the case with Pokemon. There's literally hundreds of Pokemon. So yeah, they could always add more spirits. I don't see why that's different to like, it's like, well, you know, they did this Resident Evil spirit event, but they could still add a Resident Evil character because they, there's so many Resident Evil characters that could be spirits, you know? I mean, it, it all comes down to just to speculation and theory. Like, yeah, it's a, you could speculate that they might still do a Pokemon character despite the fact they already did a Pokemon Spirit event, but then you could speculate that for literally any series anyway. So I, I'm choosing right now to, to fall into the train of thought that Spirit events are probably characters that are not going to be represented with a playable, but, I mean, if they do reveal a Pokemon, I'll have to you know, rethink that train of thought, and that's fine. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'm going to be disappointed by anything, just because, like, all it is is a new character, no matter what. Uh, there are definitely things I would be more excited to see. Like, I, I would be ecstatic to finally see Gino. Yeah. Uh, I know that my other most wanteds are, aren't going to happen. Uh, no. <laughs> at, the, at this point, like, I'm pretty sure uh, Tingle, Ray, and Isaac aren't going to happen. Fall guy. All right. Come on. Hi Ola, welcome to welcome to the chat. Um, scratch the kitty for me. I already was. <laughs> she was on my lap for a while. All right. She, she, the thing is, she wants me to leave. I've been watching Naruto to pass the time to reveals. So this story just gutted Sakura, so I can't wait to get back to that. Is this Shippuden oh. or is this? Because I don't remember her get. I watched the original series, but I never watched Shippuden. So oh, he's talking about, if he's talking about Sasori, then it must have been. It must be Shippuden. Okay. Because I don't think Sakura ever actually gets hurt in the main series. Well, she does that. She does that fight against um, uh, Dosu Keen and Zaku from the Sound Village, um, where she kind of holds them off with traps and Genjutsu, and then actually starts physically fighting, which is pretty awesome, uh, until Rock Lee shows up to save her. Yeah. That's what I remember is I, I remember she never actually gets seriously hurt in the main series because they really do damsel her constantly. Yeah, because like, even in that fight, I mean, she gets punched in the head multiple times. They're not like hard punches. It's just Sakura's like, "Stop biting my arm! Stop biting my arm!" It's not like he, is she. I I, I, I just never saw her actually bleeding much. I guess is the main thing. Uh, well, and, the, and then she yeah. and Eno knocked herself out in the tournament. Could, knocked each other out. <laughs> Kai's glad he got here for Naruto talk. Uh, <laughs> so, Sword and Shield Spirits happen to promote the new games. Pokemon Company may not have wanted to wait a few years to get that promotion. That's fair. Yeah, it could be. Sakura got punched out a few times in OG. Right, but I mean, like, none of the big bloody, like, oh, wow, like, that's that's a lot of damage. No, I don't remember any of that stuff happening to Sakura in the main. Uh, like, comparatively. When you compare to, like, Naruto or Sasuke, who they got, like, all this blood running down them the whole time. Yeah, I remember. I remember Sakura getting the just the wind knocked out of her. Yeah, because they always yeah. But in Shippuden, I, yeah, she gets in serious. Yeah, fights. I, I heard in Shippuden she's like trained by Tsunade and she starts like 
actually fighting. Oh yeah, for sure. I didn't know Sakurai was in Naruto. <laughs> Who is Sakurai. Gino? Gino from uh, Super Mario RPG. He's been like a... So, Gino's always been like a contentious topic because a lot of people, they, they say like he's only been in a couple games, like only one real game. And, yeah, there's uh, a pretty well-known uh, competitive smasher who's just like, it's it's he's just trolling, but he's like turned his entire account to this Gino hate account as of yesterday, and he's just been making all of these anti-Gino jokes. Look, man, for a character to be that popular with their one appearance, I think, says something. Yeah. And it's also like, I, I, he's I do made too. of guns. He's made of guns. Morning's he's in order. Not only, not only is he made of guns and he's like this gunslinger character, he's also a spellcaster. It's like two fighting styles combined into one, neither of which are overly represented in Smash yet. Especially not combined. Yeah. Like, I'm thinking... The, the closest thing to what he does would genuinely be me gunner which nobody wants to play so right yeah like let him although he was a me gunner costume in smash 4 well yeah but he hasn't shown up yet which is really Not weird yet. yeah although they finally after such a long time they finally had brought back the heihachi costume yeah that was weird it's like why did you wait so long it came out of nowhere i guess we could also see speaking of that i guess we could also see a namco character Hey, Zenora. We could see a Namco character. Oh, yeah, sure. Prince. Actually, Naruto. Namco Namco Bandai does all the anime games, don't they? Well, at least they do all the Naruto ones. Yeah, they do most of the anime games. It's either them or uh, now now Arc System Works has been taken on ones, which is great. I mean, that's always the thing, too, is we could see, like, Soul Bad Guy. An Arc System Works character. I would be surprised to see Arc System Works, but I wouldn't be on. I would. I wouldn't be mad about it. It would be opposed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It'd be. It'd be. It'd be really cool to like see. Uh, see a company like that represented. Uh, I just wouldn't be expecting it over one of the Yo, bigger ones. I know she's much much lower on the list, but if you do look at Source Gaming's like big um, thing, one of the characters on there is Saber from Fate Stay Night. Like, well, yeah, she's technically liable. I am still waking up. Uh, maybe they weren't sure if they wanted to include Heihachi in Pass 2, so they held off on returning his Mii costume until now. That's what I'm thinking. It was a, another consideration, and then they were like, well, no. Which means... That they might have picked a different Namco character. <laughs> the Prince. Uh, the Prince. Which means... Gino could have been consideration. Yes, that would be my guess, too. And yet, they didn't suddenly drop his costume yet. Not yet. Hey, Ola dude, I am also tired. I'm still waking up. I, I have been on a really bad sleep schedule for a while, and I'm forcing myself to try and break it for this. Oh, man, we're five minutes out. Yeah, there's I'm still several third-party me costumes missing from Wii U. Sure. Sure. But none of them are Gino. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to think of who. I oh, think man, we're I missing... There. Who else are we missing? We're missing Gino, and I think we're missing... What's that one game by... I think it's Square Enix. Oh, God, I don't even know that much. It's like the Tower Tower of Duralga? Dural- I don't remember. But there was a costume based on that. Look, I don't think that... <sighs> I saw some people I, speculating... I, I don't think they have Chocobo hat either. I saw some people speculating uh, Rex as another first-party character. A lot of people are, are anticipating yeah. that. Good morning, you two. Oh, Miss Minnie's here. I also wouldn't be disappointed, but I don't have anyone else I need to see now that we got Min Min. There's still a few I'd like, but I'm not clamoring for right now. It's good to see somebody who, like, Min Min was, like, a heavily desired thing for them. Because somebody remarked... I can't, I can't remember who it was. Somebody remarked that, like, Min Min was, like, the least hype reveal. Which yeah, is weird, I mean, she was following up on Byleth. But I see that, I see that from reveal. everything. There are, there are some yeah. people who think Byleth was the worst. There are some pe- still some people who think Terry was the worst. There are some people who thought Joker was the worst. There's always going to be... You know, people have their opinions. So, I mean, whatever. I mean, as far as, as, as that stuff goes for me, uh, I'm not really... For one thing, 
for one thing, I've gotten, I all personally have pretty much already gotten every character I ever, like, really, really want. Yeah, you get, Smash like, Smash. Ultimate, Ultimate. I got, I got everything. Ultimate, already. Ultimate, Ultimate, like, chewed through your list. It was really, it, it was really frustrating to see as none of mine got addressed. <laughs> because, like, okay, because growing up, it was always Little Mac. They gave me Little Mac and Smash 4. And I'm like, man, okay, so the top runners on my list would be, like, oh, you know, Ridley, King K. Ghoul, Banjo Kazooie, the Dragon Quest hero, Simon Belmont. And, and they just, they all got added. And so, yeah, I, I would like to see Rayman, sure. I would also like to see Ryu Hayabusa, and I would like to see, uh, I mean, those are my big ones, really. Um, but like, Or Phoenix Wright, of course. But um, but yeah, like, I, I, I can't be disappointed when the game is pretty much already as, as perfect as I had always hoped. So, like, there's, there's nothing, that, anything that they add now is going to be exciting for me because I'm just like, Oh god, a new fighter for Super Smash Brothers, and I like Super Smash Brothers enough where that just excites me. Kazuma Kiryu. That would be awesome. Majima Goro. Oh yeah, Majima Goro would be really good actually. I don't think y y uh, Yakuza is gonna happen. I would yeah, I would lose my not. mind if it did. It would be great. Like but... that'd be that'd be phenomenal. Mainly want Dixie, but that ain't happening. I don't see why. Not. We'll see. It would be really nice. Just I would. So that we I would get, expect like... it. I would expect it to be a third party this time, just because we've gotten yeah. two first. Yeah, we gotten two first party in a row, and if this was supposed to be an E three reveal, like I could expect it being. I, I not expect. I guess. I well, it, it also party. does depend on like the nature of the pass, because I don't know. Maybe they decided, oh, let's do all Nintendo characters this time for this pass. You, you know? They, who you knows? think they would have announced that? Oh. Well, maybe. Well, maybe not. <laughs> I think Hayabusa and Travis are fairly likely, but maybe not today. Oh, yeah. A lot of people have been talking about Travis. I forgot about that. Yeah, I think I think Min Min was a good choice uh, for an ARMS character because her gimmick plays well with... Uh, her, her gimmick plays well with uh, the way that Smash's, like, engine works. And, she, yeah, she's one of the more popular characters. I know a lot of people want are... like... Oh, let's ban this person. Yep. We are less than a minute out, supposedly. It's time? It's time! I've, I've still got one minute left on my clock. Same. Maybe they're just, like, just hyped. After that would be I am. than Hero. I was really excited about Hero. Um, it was nice to see... It was nice to see Dragon <laughs> Quest. Whoa, I wanted to buy those followers! <laughs> no, no, no luck. Somebody showed up to the Monster Hunter stream last night uh, offering to sell me professional Twitch overlays, so I told them to contact me at hello at jontronshow.com. Oh, let's go! Wow. Is it happening for you? It's not yes. happening for me. Oh. I'll, I'll refresh it. Four, three, two, one. I gotta... I'm just gonna... Oh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna hold on to my reaction until you... Uh, until you react. Oh, because uh, uh, you're seeing it? Okay. Okay, oh, I got a battlefield now. Mario! Mario! In. Okay, we're, act we're actually even. Great, perfect. Okay. So they're, they're just going to have him drop onto the battlefield. Wow, this is really loud in my ears. I would turn oh. it down if I could, but uh, a little busy watching now. I don't want to mess anything up, potentially. <laughs> uh, What is this? Whoa. Something spooky? I think this is third party. Yeah. Wait, is Minecraft! It Minecraft! Thing? This is a box! It's Minecraft! It's oh, Minecraft! You're right! It's Steve! What Whoa! the fuck? Yo, oh Ver my god! Vergaben redeemed! Wow! What the that? fuck? Oh, that's awesome! Oh my god, this is, I want to see how they do him. This is going to be great. I want to see like how like ecstatic he is with his movements. It would fit, it would be Oh, oh my nice god. Stage. What the fuck? Okay. Oh my god, yes. Look how static <laughs> he is. That's awesome. Oh, he's got the lava smash. Yes. <laughs> I always wanted that. He can make food? Oh, I love the piston throw. That's great. You know what? And he can build the blocks! This is awesome! Oh my god! And he can mine materials in the ground! He's and crafting! He can craft. Yo. Oh my god, he does everything! What dude, I bet I bet they weren't gonna do it until they saw your uh, your your for Smash video. Oh yeah. Yo, right. he's got an app. 
and cool. okay. and half the alter Alex, so that's good. I'm hoping unless she's, yeah. an, unless she's an Echo. I'm hoping they gave it, her, her own screen. I'm hoping well, they did that with Violet. Too, I'm hoping it's a costume alt and not. It, it must be. Well, I guess we'll find out. Oh man, this looks fantastic. Okay, it's got to be. Are it's got to be. It's got to be. Are they, all costumes. They must be doing like the eight costume thing, like with Hero. Yeah. Enderman. <laughs> That's funny. You know what? I'm oh, this is. Oh my You're god. You're excited? I'm, I'm excited. so well done. I'm excited about what this will mean for the competitive scene. Steve this is, is so Steve, well done. Steve is going to have the most clearly defined hit boxes in the game. That's true. They're just boxes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is the stage randomized? That would be cool. It looks like a like Mario it. Maker type. Whoa, okay, what's the final smash? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing! That's amazing! Oh man! <laughs> I... Oh man! Oh, that's a great victory Dude. screen. That's a great victory screen. Dude, I. They, it's it's amazing, like, cause during during like the that actual was, that was three minutes. <laughs> your your live soccer, I. <laughs> wow, they really added Minecraft. That's cruel. You said cruel. I said cool. Uh -huh. I think I was trying to find crazy and cool. Yeah, look the record show. Well, I gotta turn off closed captions. That was making it real confusing. Uh, they were trying to make English captions out of him speaking Japanese, and it was covering the uh, actual English translation. Oh. So is he basically saying that they were gonna do Steve earlier, but had to cut it? I don't know. And then they found a way to make it work. But apparently Nintendo executives uh, asked him. So I think this redeems Vergaben and kind of clears up what was going on with him. Like, could be, it, yeah, it could be an early talk thing. So that's what it is. Yeah, he's talking about. So they probably were trying to do it before. <laughs> yeah, I can do it. <laughs> Wow, the chat is really happy about this. That's good. Usually, I'm, I usually turn off, like, I'm, I'm talking about the YouTube chat. Usually I turn off the chat because I'm like, oh, they're just going to complain the whole time. But they're really happy about this. Look, I'm just happy when I'm caught by surprise. Like, I genuinely had given up. I, I, I had expected not to see him because there was so much hype and expectation for him in the main round of speculation. That when it didn't happen, I was like, okay, it's not happening. But it happened. Yeah, he was talking just now that he had, he had they had to like accommodate every single stage in the game to be able to have block placement. Yeesh. That's true. Yeah, if it's terraforming. So this is more than three minutes now. It, it was a three minute. Here's the character. Now he is explaining. Which That's is what, cool. Which is what I was I'm happy about that. So I wonder how long this will actually go. Right. Oh, does that mean it's not ready yet? ま、そう思うんですけれども、それ以上のいろいろなプレゼンというのはやっぱりこの行いたいと思っています。今までのファイターとは全く異なる。ああ、man。Very there, I didn't know Minecraft Live was a oh. thing. Minecraft Craft mode, survival mode, Oh, he prefers survival mode to creative. Right. Of course he does. Oh, I guess that's it. Steve, Alex, no so in two days, they're going to do more in-depth in the character. So that means the character might actually come out soon, after all. Minecraft Live will introduce a new update to Minecraft. It was leaked yesterday. All right. All right. Well. Wow. Well, how about that? That is awesome. Not, I did not expect that. Oh, man. Who was it? I think it's... Is it Introspective who's going to be really happy about that? I think so. All right. So they're saving Gino for the last slot on the pass. That must be it. <laughs> that's a good E3 reveal, too, actually. Yeah. That, that, that's a huge E3 reveal. It's one of the largest properties in gaming. 
Like, it's... Oh! Oh, wait! This is the second time now that it's been a character I've done a video on. I think a lot of people did videos on Steve, though. Yeah. And that one was... Uh, that one was a fan request too, so you know. Yeah, I remember you weren't gonna do it until somebody requested it, because there yeah, was so, because right. there were so many videos on it, and somebody asked you to do it, and it was like, okay, well, all right, they paid me. <laughs> but all right, let's look back through these comments. There's gonna be a lot of people who are gonna hate this, but I definitely think it's better that Banjo got revealed first. But I know some people are gonna be excited. I can't wait to show my brother. I think it's first character he's gonna be legitimately excited for. That's another thing. It's gonna hit a whole generation of kids who. Uh, Smash might have missed before? Because there, there are a lot of kids who only played Minecraft. Maybe this won't bring them around to actually playing Smash. It's still such an icon. I forget sometimes that Minecraft's been around for over 10 years at this point. It, it basically has a legacy on its own. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, that's two Microsoft refs. Neither of them In a row on the E3 reveals. My favorite thing, <laughs> neither of them are actually characters that Microsoft developed. No, 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 no. Oh, wait, what, who, what does Microsoft have that they've developed themselves? I mean, even even Halo is Bungie originally. Sure, sure but it, it was but it was paid for and developed in house under Microsoft. Yeah, yeah. Like, but uh, well, not in house, I guess. But it was it, like it was made while they were part of Microsoft. Like right. they, they they bought up Minecraft and Banjo Kazooie. <laughs> yeah, it's just, it's just kind of funny. So all they got to do is just keep buying uh, properties that are already in Smash and. Uh, we're good. So ever since I've done, I did the, uh, the next Minecraft. Mi oh, sorry. <laughs> the next Microsoft character is going to be the Dragonborn. That'd be cool. I find. Yeah, that's right. Because now a Bethesda character would be another Microsoft character. <laughs> that's so funny. Like I, I love what they did with the final smash. I actually, I, I just love the whole move set. It's it's so good. It's so good. <laughs> Twitter is broken. Oh, apparently Twitter, Twitter, Twitter's down. Oh, because so many people are posting about it. I mean, that's like I said, that's a big thing of Minecraft is it has such a huge following, and it's so, world, like and it's worldwide too. Like it's also yeah. it's it's something that's not particular to uh, to just like ah oh, American fans or Japanese fans are really into this. Which like, is, I mean, I like Banjo and Hero, but that's exactly what they are. <laughs> yeah. Um, but my, Minecraft is like a worldwide thing. I immediately thought Gino when Mario's getting all the focus. That's fair. It was it was that right there. I was like, wait, that was really like squared off. Uh, it was it, when, when Mar. Sorry, yeah. But like when when it really came clear was when he's looking at the wall. I realized like, wait, these have been entirely Minecraft assets. Oh okay. And yeah, when it, and, and, and then I and then I looked at the wall and I was like, oh yeah, that's the dirt texture from Minecraft. <clears throat> okay, I didn't pick up on that. For me, like to be fair, when, it when, is when very he... grainy. When he got into uh, the uh, dark area, uh, I was like, oh, are they adding, like, a horror game character or something? <laughs> but, yeah. Gino's Final Smash is just a copy of Villagers. It's pretty funny, though. Like, the, the, the comedy behind it is pretty great. Oh, man. I just... So, the version of the Minecraft map that is, uh... That has, like, a little... The, the houses and the farm in the background is the coziest thing. So it looks like, yeah, yeah he makes food. He can upgrade his weapons. Builds blocks. He can, he can mine materials out of the floor. He can use, uh, I think it looked like a special move to me rather than a throw. We'll have to see that the piston attacks with the fishing rod. I wanted Chris punch bolt. That could whatnot. actually just be a fishing rod grab. That would make sense. And then piston throws. Which is something a lot of people speculated. It might just be that. It's gonna be cool. It's gonna be like a it wildly is. different thing. I, man, I just, I, I really, I really do want Vergaben to like, because, because Minecraft, <laughs> Minecraft is the thing that like ruined his credibility. It was he was like, he was like, I'm sure this is happening. I'm not sure when, and it just kept not happening. And so everybody was like, Yeah, he's full of shit. I'm like, but he predicted so many other things that like, seem like they'd be difficult to know. So I think I, mean, I, I, I I always figured it was something like a Gamatsu thing where it was like okay oh, this was obviously planned at some point just either the plans got delayed or they changed 
You know, like yeah. we, we can we can almost prove now. We can almost prove that yes, Smash Four originally did intend to have Crom and a Rhythm Heaven character playable, and then at some point those plans changed. And I kind of figured that the Minecraft was that situation too. Only now with you know DLC and not having to return any veterans, they can come back to those ideas. Yeah. Uh, is the crouching his crouch or his taunt? Uh, it looked like a taunt to me because he also like turned and looked at the camera. Um, actually, it might have been his stage entrance as well. Huh. Yeah, how are they gonna have him taunt? He doesn't have knees or crouch. He doesn't have knees. Well, I'm, I'm assuming the the food eating is going to be like the, 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 the I don't know maybe. Interesting. Oh, how, how, are, how are they gonna have him crouch? You're saying? Yeah, how are he they might actually. Just, he might just do the Minecraft crouch. The that you know is not actually very good. <laughs> So that, that's like one of his downsides is he can't really reduce his hitbox. Not that crouching is actually a huge part of uh, Smash. Not really. Yeah. I'm so happy about Ultimate's roster that I can't really be upset at anything. But this would be really happy to see. I'm just I'm just glad I was caught completely off guard. Like that was like my, like Steve did not come up in our discussion at all. No, that's it's, true. He didn't. <laughs> it's, 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 it's it's something that we discussed a lot before. And then it didn't happen, and because we expected it to happen, like, at that time, like, well, it was because Banjo-Kazooie happened, too. Could be, yeah. Yeah. Use the bet as a crouch. Is Steve our first <laughs> Geomancer? Yeah. I, that's a good way yeah, to look at it. Yeah, or Terraformer, or Geomancer, but that's true, too. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm curious how much control he's going to have over the stage, how much build... It, lo it looks like the blocks... Uh, break over time, like, pretty rapidly. And I bet you can hurry it up by hitting them. Um, and I don't know if it was because of speed or because of block limit or both, but, like, it looked like to build that house structure, they needed, like, four Steves. So, yeah. you know. Well, I, I feel like if you genuinely could block people in all the time, it could get... Broken. Yeah, it opens up the door for things to get broken real fast. But it looked like one could do th at least three bricks at a time. Uh... <sighs> yeah, it looks like one could do at least three bricks at a time. Interesting Nintendo specifically asked for Steve. I'm not surprised. Like, if, if it's if it's corporate that came to Sakurai asking for... Which is what it sounds like. It's like, hey, can you put the best-selling video game of all time into into Smash Brothers? Yeah. Uh, I would, yeah. <laughs> I, would, I, would not be, I would not be surprised at all for, for Steve to have been a corporate request. Oh, yeah. Uh, it, it, that's what it sounded like. Yeah. So. Whereas I think Joker from Persona sounded more like a something that Sakurai, Sakurai really wanted to do. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I was actually surprised Banjo made it before Steve, to be honest. That's the thing. Yeah, when Banjo happened, I, I think that's when the Steve discussion died. It's because they were yeah. like, there's no way my Not that it like, disappeared, but it definitely was much lower. Cause for, yeah, because for most people, they were like, all right, that's the Minecraft rep. Or, or Microsoft the Microsoft rep. thing, yeah. Thank you, Chelsea. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, <laughs> Chelsea, you, you you know what Minecraft is? Minecraft, Minecraft is going to be in Smash Brothers now. So that's pretty. That that's that's the general gist. Uh, and it surprised. I think everybody. I don't think anybody went into today expecting this reveal. I'm going to see if I can load uh, Twitter. It's already about brother smashing things? <laughs> Twitter is not loading for me. <laughs> yeah, Twitter and, and like Twitter exploded with how surprising this reveal was because it's combining Man. two of the most popular game series of all time. And so Twitter is now down. Um, wow. Microsoft got a second character before Namco. That's fair. Namco's helping develop the game. Oh, ouch. Yeah. Not only that, but Heihachi's been, like, deconfirmed at this point. So. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. I really... I'm very surprised. Irish Supreme Court rules that Subway bread isn't bread. Is this real? Fair. Um, I'm, I'm getting messages from people that are like, oh, I wonder how accurate your moveset's going to be. Well, they have crafting, they have block placing, and they even have the uh, the bug wings. So that's three out of four. It looks like it looks like upgrading the weapons is a thing too. Uh, yeah. You you said that you you put uh, putting on armor in your moveset, didn't you, or did you not? I I did. Okay. It doesn't look like that's happening. 
I don't. I, it doesn't. It doesn't look like it now. And I'm trying to remember what did what did I do for you're the a throws? fraud. What's that? What did I what did what did I do for the throws in the Steve Woo? So I don't uh, even. Oh, using weapon hits, and it looks like they're using pistons, which is a great idea. Yeah. Because I did everything based on like, oh, this type of weapon hit, that type of weapon hit, which doesn't look like it's the case. I mean, from from what we saw, I think it's just you upgrade your weapon, and then that's all the weapon attacks use it. I, I wonder. Know. I wonder if you'll be able to bury people with the uh, with the mining move. That'd be cool. Which I bet is yeah, the, special. It, it looks like the only like direct special move that I'm not sure about because I did minecart as the side B. I, I don't know. I know they had, it looked like they had the TNT in there somewhere, but I don't know what kind of move it was. They did Lava Bucket. I did mine as an up smash, I think. The Lear's was a down smash. I don't remember if I, I think I made mine up smash. I did a bow forward smash. I don't think they're going to do that. I, I just, wonder if they're even going to have bow at all. I just noticed that the zombies have mouths. The way they do, yeah. the way they do mouths in Minecraft is so weird to me. Well, like, I always thought, and a lot of people always thought, we always thought that, that Steve had a big, goofy smile, but that's actually a goatee. And it's like, oh. Oh, I figured that. I didn't understand that until someone pointed it out to me. Yeah, because then his actual mouth is right above that. I thought it was a big, dopey smile with, a, with like, a little button nose. <laughs> Minecraft is so far off my map of, map of interest that I forget about its popularity. Yeah, everybody's, everybody's got blind spots. It's just remember the remember the whole like nobody knows who Terry is, like thing that happened when Terry got revealed. Where while like the entire fighting game community was losing their mind over it. Oh yeah, I mean I was I was like oh my god yeah <laughs> Terry. But uh, but then yeah then I um, I remembered from the reactions I remembered oh yeah not everyone knows a lot about arcade fighters. Well. That's that's the <laughs> thing is is like gaming isn't. The gaming One community genre. isn't a huge circle. It's a bunch of different circles. It's it's literally hundreds of circles. Like, well, right. Like, probably the reason I'm not so huge on Doom Slayer is because I don't play a lot of FPS games in general. Like, Whereas someone who is, like, runs in the FPS, like, circle, I mean, Doom Slayer is probably the closest thing they have to their Mario, where it's like, oh, this is the classic icon that started it all, you know? Like, I'm... I, I, I It's really... It's, it's really impressive how many communities there are in gaming that literally just play one game like how many games there are that have large fan bases of people who only play that and i'm like it's not just mmos like mmos are one of the primary like you know, right you know, groups, groups for that but like how many people there are that really only play overwatch or only play counter-strike uh and Mine minecraft is definitely one of those yeah there's a ton of people that only play minecraft um sakurai acknowledged twitter going down Oh, he did? Wait, where? On uh, Twitter? On Twitter. <laughs> Sakurai just tweeted out, perhaps Twitter has fallen. Oh, that's funny. Even Not that I, I can King see of Fighters, it. I never thought I'd be in Smash, but it was high for me. Well, yeah, because I think the fighting game community uh, felt like they weren't going to get a lot of representation. You know, they got they got Ryu, which made sense because he's like the fighting because game character. <laughs> But, but then uh, where do you go from there? I mean, I, a lot of people thought they might do Tekken. A lot of people thought that wasn't very likely because it would be hard to implement. And then we got Terry. <laughs> I do wonder what made him want to go with King of Fighters. Because it, it did seem like, yeah, it was uh, moving past what some people would say were bigger fighting games. I mean, well, I mean they, know, they, argue they, they were bigger fighting games. We um, do know that... Um, that Sakurai himself is a particular fan of King of Fighters, so it might have been a Joker type thing. That'll do it. The website is updated. Twitter is back up. Twitter's back up. I think Terry is more of a personal choice for him. Yeah, I think I think Joker and Terry are where his personal preferences really came through. Uh, Banjo Kazooie was definitely done for the fans. Dragon Quest Hero was done for the fans and also for Legacy. Um, and then Byleth was. Byleth was Byleth. Still waiting on Sinventi or Malenko. Oh, oh web, web I, I, the other four costumes. I'm, I'm guessing that now at this point it's going to be just alts for Alex, uh, Steve, Zombie, and Enderman. I don't know. Uh, what's the Smash website thing? Is it just SmashBros.com? I, I've never. I don't go to the Smash site. Nope. 
Is it just is it Smash Bros. All right. Not the Nintendo site. All right. Fighters. What are the costumes? That didn't help. Oh. Okay. So the, it looks like the other costumes are just like more interesting like palette swaps. Are these are these like are these like really well known costumes or no? I know Steve and Alex are. I don't see the I only see two costumes. I don't see There's like a guy with a kilt. Click on Steve. Oh, I did click on Steve. Sounds like Iori was his fave. Terry might have been SNK's choice, I think. Well, he's the face of the series, right? Yeah. That, if you're going to have an SNK fighter, it, it's weird to imagine it being anybody but Terry. I think. I think a lot of people would agree. Are you seeing these? Uh, are you seeing these costumes? No. Is this is this redhead with a suit and with a suit jacket and a kilt? Like, is that like a really well known? Uh, here, I'll, I'll take a look at them. Oh, Man. okay. Oh, a sports guy, tennis guy. Looks like tennis. Okay, female tennis. Sorry, yeah, I was looking at Twitter reactions. Uh, let's see here. Steven a suit and kilt. It's interesting. A lot of people like it um, on Twitter. Oh, this is I, this is definitely a reference to uh, to to it being Swedish, right? I, I am following a few people who are kind of like, I wish they would just let Sakurai pick who he wants and not have any influence from the devs. I'm like, eh. You gotta please everybody. You I can't just make a game that pleases Sakurai and nobody else. I didn't realize you could change costumes by clicking on the characters like that. I learned a new thing today. Oh, wait, you can? Oh, sorry, how do I do this shit? <laughs> oh, you're on your phone. Fighter. Right. Yeah. Fighters, Steve Alex. It's a, okay, yeah, that works on mobile, too. Okay, so I see there's a blonde tennis dude. Yeah. There's which, a, which, a girl tennis person. There's a girl, there, there's a girl tennis dude. <laughs> Okay, so Zombie and Enderman are just one costume, and then they basically have different... They have different skins, but they're they're half and half male and female. Yeah, it's, so that's it's, it's three Steve and Alex skins, and then Zombie and Enderman, which is pretty cool. That's great. That's good. Oh, they they do have a minecart attack. I'm four for four. Yeah, that was that was in the clip. Nice. I, were, I just missed it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, crazy. there are some there are some prudes that are like tweeting like I can't believe I woke up to just to watch Steve get revealed. So fuck them. What, what are they, what <laughs> Even they, though what some of them want? are friends of mine, fuck them. <laughs> what do they want? This is one of the most surprising reveals possible. Like, I'm not looking for just my personal like most wanted characters. Like that like that's cool, sure. But I'm not gonna get up early for that because like, for for that stuff, it's just the news is what I'm looking for. If that's what I cared about, like, I wouldn't have to watch any of these. I would just wait for them to be in the game. The wings being in makes me happy. Those were the most fun items in the game. Well, it makes sense as a recovery, right? Like, it's one of the most unique recoveries they can get. Girl tennis dude, man. <laughs> Terry was the first fighting game protag for SNK as a whole, yeah. Yeah. I, 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 man, I'm, I'm really happy it was a third party. I'm happy it's something that is wildly outside of everything else we've seen up to this point. What a cool effect. This is just good programming. Man, that, that, that really is cool. Yeah. Just the fact that it works like this. Man. Hell yes. You excited? You excited, Anthony? I guess, yeah, you are a big Minecraft guy, aren't you? <laughs> Apparently, like, Steve's placement on the mural is just him popping out of the ground. <laughs> I gotta... Where is the mural? Uh, it's Yeah, and he's between, like, Snake and Sonic popping out of the ground. He's not on the scrolling mural yet, it looks like. Okay. Okay. That's enough Twitter impressions. Like I said, uh... 
a lot of the people I follow are just kind of like, oh, I'm not big on Minecraft, but that was a cool reveal. And then there are some people who are like, I can't believe I woke up early for that. Then some people are, are happy about it. It seems like the standard thing. I'm probably just going to avoid looking at Twitter for a while. I just don't care. Oh, yeah. I mean, I I have stuff to do after this. is After we're done, I'm going to uh, go do some private tutoring. Oh, That's man. my job now. <laughs> oh, I got a good idea for a meme. All right. I need to... Am I going to actually take the time to make this? It's so Mario's in the thing. The door, like, breaks open. And it's just, like, white light. And then, uh, All Might comes sliding in. He's just like, I am here! It's just, <laughs> you, we, we just take the, uh... I guess, no, actually, it would be Deku. It's, it, because it's, it'd be from that flashback where, where Deku, like, surprises his mom, basically. Oh! Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd have to, I'd have to rotate. Yeah, I'd have to, I'd have to rotoscope him out. <laughs> yeah. That's the thing, because I, I have I have a version of that clip with uh, Deku taken out, so that I can like throw other things in there. Um, but I need to like manufacture the reverse if I want to do this. Okay. This is when you normally wake up. Hype for the full presentation. I'm wondering how long the presentation is going to be and what style it's going to be. I probably won't stream the presentation. Uh, no, I don't think. But I, but I'll watch it. Let me some Minecraft. Also the the pink one. Favorite minimum and all. Uh, the black and red's pretty good. I like the teal and pink as well. Uh, what will Kirby? Oh boy, look like? I I wonder if anyone's commenting on my video. Oh, what, what what will Kirby look like? That's a because people commented on my. Yep, yep. Okay. I'm glad this wasn't five years ago. Dumb kid me would have been pissed as hell. Yeah, I think uh, if, I think if this happened during Smash Four speculation, I would have been a bit of an asshole about it. Oh, I would have been too. I have no idea what people would be like, Byleth level angry, this is hype. Uh, a lot of people built up resistance to Steve because they see him as a dumb kids character. And yeah. they are I'm not. I'm not seeing kids. so far anyway. I'm sure it exists somewhere. I'm not seeing Byleth level yet. I mean, that's the thing, like... Uh, uh, oh, who else did it happen with? It happened with something else. Um, nope, nobody knows who Terry is. A lot of... So, something that either children or I, I guess man children people who r reach an unfortunate age without becoming secure in themselves uh tend to do is uh tie their worth to whether or not they like things that they see as childish and so they will just hate things that they see as childish minecraft has a largely child fan base um they said now that it's been out for so long a lot of those children who liked it are uh, adult now <laughs> yeah Stephen Byleth been my favorite character from each fighter pass so far. Well, you're you're huge on three, like you love three houses though, so that like, like Byleth like totally tracks for you. Most people saw Terry and Shulk and thought, I don't know them, but they look yeah. awesome. Th weren't there complaints about Shulk? Or I guess oh, actually, there's complaints about everybody. Well, I think I think Shulk happened before people were like complaining the like too many anime swordsmen thing. No, well, I do remember complaints when Shulk came out of like, oh, you know, no one knows what Xenoblade is. Xenoblade's not even that great type of thing. It's like, well, there's just That's one, simply one not game true. here and they just add No, of course not. Usually, like, most of the times when people complain about these things, they're not true. Don't you fair. remember all the Ricky is too big arguments? Like, jeez. People, people love clinging on to shit that's just not true. Yeah, that's fair. We're under a presidency about this. Yes. Drag him. <laughs> Oh, man. Do you remember the part of the debate where uh, Trump said Villager couldn't be in because he wasn't a fighter? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that was wild. <laughs> Steve for sure has been my favorite DLC pick. Yeah, that's, if it hits your personal sweet spot, that's, like, fantastic. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'm trying to remember. Yeah, so I, I know I know at least a few people who like really, really wanted Steve and Smash, and so that's that's always fantastic for them. Like I always say, you know, even though I'm not like a big fan of the idea of more Pokemon, not not that's not I'm not opposed to like more Pokemon joining Smash. I just don't think an eighth gen Pokemon in particular would be the most exciting Super Smash Brothers edition comparatively. That said, I follow 
more than a few people that would just be ecstatic about it. And I did a tweet about this. I, that makes it worth it for me. It's just like, oh man, I would love to see these people happy. Well, cause, <laughs> well, cause Pokemon is also one of those circles where again, like people who almost exclusively play Pokemon and will They're like, very attached yeah, to Pokemon. Yeah, like, yeah. absolutely. Um, and, and man, well, you, I think it was, YouTube's... I think it was uh, Tale of the Toaster was pointing out yesterday. It's like, that would come up with some really cool music. I'm like, that's true. Sword and Shield does have some really cool music. Yeah. I mean, speaking look, of music, the 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 music they were playing during Steve's reveal was pretty dang good. I'm excited to yes. hear the, what 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 Minecraft tracks they do. Man, Steve rocks the block. The trailer, so the the trailer video is called a new seed. A new seed. Oh, okay, because yeah, that's what it's, it's called when you make a new world. Kirby Kirby, right. Kirby hat has been revealed. It's QB Kirby, so he just turns into a cube, I guess. Okay. All right. I do like that Kirby has a mechanic that means that every time a character gets revealed, there's a Kirby. They have to update. Well, yeah. someone's pointed that in my video too. It's like, wow, Kirby's in every video. It's like he has to be. <laughs> yeah, Kirby has to be the most complicated like character to program at this point. They've got to account for over seventy different like hats, like changes to his uh, changes to his appearance yeah, and possible yeah. like moves that he can have. That's yeah, wild. That's nuts. That's really wild. I think it's a mod, not real. We'll see. Because uh, it's not officially on the page. Well, yeah, because people mm. have been posting on Twitter. People, A lot of people have been posting to various different, like, old pictures I did of, see, like, what Kirby would look like. I did, but I there did might see be Cube an, Kirby I before. Checked. I did see Cube Kirby before Steve got revealed, for sure. Like, over a year ago, we saw that, uh, that render going around. Yeah. We got our first indie fighter. That's true. Technically, technically, yeah. Do you still count Minecraft as an indie after it's been bought by a AAA company? It started that way, at least. It's the closest thing yeah. that we have now. Yeah. Of course, Sakurai would want the most work put on Kirby. Yeah. <laughs> Fair I, enough. I, you know what? I guarantee that it's something that he thought would be cool and put in in, uh, in Smash in, 64, in 64. And then over the years, he's been like, oh, my God, what have we done? Why did I do as, this? As, as the roster's <laughs> gotten bigger and bigger. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that was that was exciting. Yeah, um, my throat hurts. <laughs> mine as well. Uh, it's my my throat takes a little bit to get going in the morning. Uh, <coughs> I did try. To well, and we're starting morning. to get smoke here again, where I'm at. Yeah. Yep. That's unfortunate. If only there was something we could do to reduce all those fires. Yeah, that'd be great. Oh well. <clears throat> Guess this is just the way things gotta be. I love that That's both right. Microsoft characters are just acquired properties. Yeah, uh, Kai, we talked about we that earlier. Talked I, about I was, that I was like, bit, yeah. yeah, I was like, I was like, none of these are actually characters that Microsoft developed. Like, uh, rake the forest. Yeah, there's a lot we could do if we didn't uh, cut funding to the organizations that are supposed to manage that stuff. We also yeah, got, like, we oh, also got oh, we also got another get... sword fighter. God damn it. <laughs> do any of oh, you also have blue hair i don't think so i don't think so it was just it was manage. blonde hair brown hair just manage the forest bro i don't understand why don't they just go uh why don't we just stop lighting fires america sucks this is good <laughs> all right so we'll be we'll be we'll be sagging out of the uh smash talk version like like section of the stream and going straight into the political analysis that's right. America sucks. Smash is good. Yeah, that's fair. Smash is better than America. I can get behind that. Replace America with Smash. <laughs> the United States of Smash. Remember when we authentically thought that Abraham Lincoln might be added to Smash because of uh, Project <laughs> Steam? I always joked about that. I mean, he's, he's not even really the main character. There were some people but... who generally thought they were like, hey, this is a Nintendo IP. Yeah, yeah it wasn't very popular. Who are we going to add to Xbox All-Stars Battle Royale? We can't add Steve and Banjo now. Also true. The presentation's gonna be forty-five minutes. Okay, so probably won't stream that then. I'd be pr I'd be pretty mad to be honest if like after the the one you know flop that was codenamed Steam, if they add, suddenly added Abraham Lincoln and yet they never added Isaac from Golden Sun and never added Gino. <laughs> yeah, lose my mind. She's like, but here's Abe Lincoln. <laughs> yes, Cat. What would you like? Ugh. Man. Oh, they might have a Mii Fighter reveal? 
Maybe. Is Minecraft Live for the Minecon for this year? It seems like it's a regular thing. Maybe it's not. Maybe it is a yearly thing. I don't know. I, I'm not sure. I could Because I'm, I'm it just, you know, I did that move set and I played Minecraft and I enjoyed myself, but I'm still not actually like in the Minecraft scene. So like, I don't know. Yeah, I it's it's a game I've tried to get into many times and it's never gripped me. My, American president should never be in Smash. I would never touch Smash again if Trump got in. You don't want to. You don't want to be able to like do a seven on one, like just absolutely beating on Trump. You don't want to do that. We also got another Western character, so that's cool. That's fair. Is this our first European developed character? What was that? Is this our first like European developed character? No, banjo. Oh, right, they're British. I forgot Rare was British. Yeah, that'll do it. All right, uh, I guess we I guess we should wrap it up here. Uh, oh, let's just play the minimum trailer for fun. Oh. We'll play it this way. It's every third car- third party company in Ash with two reps now. I think Namco only has one, don't they? Yep. Yeah, Namco's only got one. Does Sega have two? I mean, do you count, do you ba- do you count, count Bayonetta? Bayonetta? Do you count Joker? Fair. Fair. I everybody looks at them as a uh, I feel as like, their own thing. I feel like everybody. I feel like everybody goes by the developer and not the publisher. Right. I think that's the thing. So if you want to go with developed Sega, then no, developed Sega only has Sonic. So I guess that's the thing. Is like, um, Minecraft technically doesn't have anything they've developed in Smash yet. Because yeah, that's right. that's really just Minecraft, Gears of War, uh, stuff like that. But. Cat. She keeps going to. So Tyler's still asleep. So she keeps going to Tyler's door and meowing at the door. <laughs> and Wake it's up! Like, just hang out here. Um. I see Atlas ever from Sega personally. Yeah, Gears of War did not get a spirit event. Cat Cam. Hey. Gears of War has not gotten a spirit event yet. No. Oh. Cat Cam. I don't even think has there ever been a Gears of War game on Nintendo. I don't remember. Uh, there has not. Okay. I didn't think so, but... There has not been. Um, yeah, because I consider consider Bayonetta a platinum character more than a Sega character. Uh, I consider... I mean, and and now now Nintendo's got the publishing rights. Uh, Mm -hmm. and I consider Joker an Atlas character and not a Sega character. So I guess that's the thing, is it's, 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 it gets kind of weird when you get into some of these larger companies are publishers as well as developers. Right. <laughs> That's what she's here for. Excellent, excellent timing. Um, I mean, the name is I'm here for cats. <laughs> yeah, that's that's Chelsea. I think right, she, I, I think she literally made that account in order to come on my streams and just ask to see the cat. <laughs> uh, that's good. But, let's see. Good. Uh, I think there's not much else to talk about. I'm excited because we'll 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 get all the we'll get all the details on the character in two days. Uh, I don't think we'll stream that. Should we do an actual Smash Talk episode at this point? It's like information has been so sparse. And well, I think it's too hard to predict anything now. Anyway, I mean, we could just for fun. Um, but yeah. yeah, yeah. Gino. I mean, there's four characters left. Four whole characters left. Yeah, that's still She's a lot. meowing outside his door again. Oh, you, 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 okay, he's awake now, and she's just meowing at him. <laughs> uh... Let's see. Saber from Fate and Catalina from Grand Blue. Let's go. Four characters left, that means one of them's gonna die. Oh. Which one's the imposter? What, dude? If how, how I know it's not going to happen, but if uh, if a character from Among Us ends up getting in, I would lose my mind. That game didn't even exist when they decided on this. Uh, it's like two years old. 
Really? Oh, yeah. okay. Well, it didn't get popular. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's the thing. Like, it, it suddenly blew up like years after it got made. Like, I didn't, I didn't realize that. Yeah, that's funny. It was just kind of around, and then a uh, streamer, uh, a bunch of big streamers started playing it, and uh, it blew up. Yeah, it blew up. That's funny. I'm unsure on Crash, but damn, do I really want him? I'd say Crash is definitely up there. If they're I if they're so. still paying attention to fan demand, Crash has been pretty consistent. He has been. And it was a really good timing, too, um, at the time that they would have been deciding the DLC characters. Yeah, a Fall Guy gets in and just trips. All, all he can do is grapple. Um, <laughs> okay, I keep saying I'm going to wrap this up. We should actually wrap it up. i got to get about okay. my day. All right. Uh, yeah, me too. Yeah, thanks for uh, thanks for joining me. Uh, yeah, you bet. Thanks for fun. having me. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was nice to... Uh, it, was, it was nice to be like completely surprised and caught off guard. Yeah, that was awesome. I'm excited to see where this goes. I hope he's not. I, I hope. I hope. I hope it's not a terribly broken character. Right. That's always good. Yeah. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you. We'll uh, see y'all later. Bye.